Hello and welcome to Maker Hanger. My name is Lucas Weekly, and today we're going to be talking about what Maker Hanger is and what we'll be covering for the next couple of weeks. But first, who am I? Well, obviously my name is Lucas Weekly. I'm a RC fanatic and I've been designing, building, flying, and crashing electric RC models for the past four years now. I first got into RC when I was about nine with a big gas trainer and I took lessons and I flew this for a while but eventually dropped it due to some complications with my schedule and that the gas plane was pretty hard to set up even though it was incredibly easy to fly. And electric planes back then weren't very advanced, they could only fly for a couple minutes on a charge and they were very heavy which made them hard to fly. Fast forward a couple of years and I picked up the hobby again with electric RC planes and I immediately found out what I had been missing all those years. Since then I've been very active in this hobby. Um, I have my own YouTube channel called BusyBTV, there's a link right here. Um, and it's a bi-weekly YouTube show where I do reviews, how-to, scratch builds, and other things to do with the RC hobby. Also, I turned my passion for RC into a career with Top View Aerials, which is my aerial videography company using multi-copters and other aerial vehicles to record real estate, events, and any other activities that people hire me to film. So as you can see, the RC hobby is very diverse with a ton of different branches coming off of it, which makes it very easy for different people with different interests to get involved. Maker Hanger is a 15 episode web show, including this one, here on Make where I'm going to be getting you from knowing nothing about electric or remote control planes to being able to identify and classify all the components, build and fly your first plane. This is the Maker Trainer, which is the plane that I designed and the one that we're going to be building in this series. You're going to need some parts from a company called Hobby King. Hobby King is an RC supplier coming out of China. Now that being said, they do take some time to send in your order. So what I recommend is to order all your parts now. And then by the time that the build series comes out for the Maker Trainer, you'll have all your parts ready. A parts list is available in the description below. And all the parts are going to cost a little bit over $200. And I know you're thinking this is a bit expensive for a hobby. But this gets you all the parts for your RC plane, including your transmitter, receiver, and battery charger, which are the most expensive components. And these aren't just proprietary components that can only be used on one plane. If you crash, you can rebuild this plane, or you can reuse all the parts and build your own plane from scratch using all the same components. So don't think of this as a $200 airplane, think of this as a $200 kickstart into the RC hobby, which will pay for many, many more RC planes in the future. Another thing you'll want before you fly is a flight simulator. This allows you to practice flying even before you actually go out and fly. This is essential when you're first starting off because it can be tricky to learn the controls of an RC plane and it's hard to do it on the fly when you're actually flying. Every time you crash in the simulator is one less time you'll crash in real life. There are a bunch of different simulators that you can get and the cheapest of which is one coming from Hobby King for about $15. But there are some more expensive ones, such as Phoenix RC coming from Horizon Hobbies, which is about $100, but you also have to supply your own compatible transmitter. You can also find some iPhone and Android simulators that you can download for free and have the same control layout as an RC controller. Now these of course aren't going to be the same as having an actual controller, but they will help you learn the directions of your controls. I've linked a couple of these below in the description. When you get your simulator, don't just wait for me, practice on it every day. That'll get you ready for when you build your plane and are ready to fly. Okay, so here's a really quick rundown of what we're going to be covering in Maker Hangar. We'll go over motors, speed controls, batteries, servos, transmitters, all the wiring for the plane, everything you need to know on how to build it, how to fly, and then we'll get into some modifications you can do to the Maker Trainer to make it fly better and also do more things. Right now is the perfect time to get into this amazing hobby. There are advances coming out every day and remote control is only growing. This is Maker Hanger. I can't wait to see you next time. Thanks for watching.